Oh well, fuck it. Oh man. 170 screen streak, Jesus Christ, dude. Thanks. Oh wow, Fantasy Star 2 starting now at Pico. G -g 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 -g. I do want to give Fantasy Star 4 another chance sometime. I've heard 4 is the best. I've heard 3 is the one that sucks. It's like the black sheep. But I had no fun with 2, so I can't even imagine how bad 3 is. And now it goes to redeem 2, 3, and 4. I mean... Can anyone here tell me which channel in the Discord shows a list of upcoming games we played? Probably announcements. Yeah, I put it in announcements. But uh, for some stupid reason, I really need to change this. There's a... Uh, rules and fucking something something. The person who made this for me made a fucking rules and welcome at the very top, and you have to click the check mark, and then you can go to, like, all the different channels and shit like that. Don't worry about getting rid of alt to black as long as your game isn't being cut off. Yeah, it's the one where he goes live from, but you gotta scroll up. It's in between the hundreds of live announcements. Oh, I'm gonna update it tonight. Uh, four is the best, but it was too easy compared to two. Too easy? Yeah, I get anything seems like it's gonna be easier than two. New update hype. What should I name him? I still think you should have a channel only you can type in where you go in and keep adding stuff to your list as you get it. That everybody just... No. Then a lot of people don't redeem shit because they're like, wow, your list is so long, I feel bad. Name him Dingus? Really? Alright. Four letters? What the fuck? Alright, whatever. Um, you like joke names? If you do, dog shit also works. Yeah, dog shit would have been nice. Four letters, though. Do fuck, question mark? I'm haunted by nightmares every night. I hear that. A young girl is battling a giant demon. I'm close by, but can't move or speak. All I can do is watch while the demon keeps striking at the girl. Dicks. Yeah, that's what sucks about early Japanese ports. Yeah, that makes sense, right? Because they were using fucking kanji and shit probably too, right? Keep striking at the girl. Just as she is fighting for her life, I awake. I wake in my room with a pee boner. Uh, dimly lit by the early dawn, I'm filled with an incredible sadness and fear. I am AIDS, an agent hero in Pasio, the capital of Mota. I shave my head as if to scatter the remnants of my lice. I have no time to worry like a child about nightmares in this modern age, especially with the mother brain planning and controlling all aspects of the environment. I open my window and take a deep breath of fresh air. It seems to wash away the bad feelings left by my dream. I fight alien demons with swords in my dream constantly. Good morning, AIDS. How are you? Almost two years have passed since you started working for me. The commander of Mota, what I am going to ask you to do will be the toughest job you will have ever done, but it is vital to the future of Mota. As you know, Algo has been brought up by Mother Brain. My work as a commander has been to smoothly promote the plans of Mother Brain. I had believed that Mother Brain never makes mistakes, but those monsters all over Mota are just too much. We must find out by ourselves why those monsters were born and how to bring them under control. AIDS, your mission is to go to the Biosystems Lab and get the recorder. If we look into the data, we can figure out how the Biosystems Lab ended up making those monsters. AIDS, I hope from the bottom of my heart that you come back safely with the recorder. We'll see each other again. This is you. In some of the newer Final Fantasy 1 translations, they combine pairs of English letters together into a single font in order to get longer names. Oh, yeah, that makes sense. After going home and preparing for the trip, Nay seems worried. Nay, I have to leave for a while. Nay stared at me for a moment. I remembered when we first met, she looked at me in just the same way. Now, seven months ago, because she was the product of a mixture of human cells and those of a biomonster. She was an outcast from society. You were still small when we first met, but now you can take care of yourself. I'm going on a dangerous journey. Too dangerous for you. I worry about you like you were my sister. Hey, it's underscore starting soon screen, dude, right? 
Oh shit, this piss? Hey, what's up, shareable? You don't like this game or what? Uh, even if text boxes had four spaces, they still had hundreds of font letters on the cartridge? Yeah. This game is piss. Still, May stood in the doorway to keep me from leaving. Please, AIDS, take me with you. I'll do anything for you. I took my sack and started to go, but Nay still blocked the way. I had no choice. <gasps> I decided to let her come with me. If there's something you would like to know about Moto, you should go to the library at the center central tower. Lick lol? I don't like playing this game? I bet. My dad is just goofing off every day. He says he can live without working. Do not get close to the bridge on the North River. Many people have been killed there by a man named Darum. I like watching it played from a safe distance, where it can't hurt me. This town is peaceful. I'm glad I moved here from Arima. It hasn't rained at all for a while. The lake even dried up. It doesn't look too bad so far. No, it's pretty. I like the music. I like the visuals. Kind of. Hunters are the coolest guys. They really are strong and so dependable. I used to work at the biosystems lab, which is on the other side of the lake. Welcome to the clone labs. Who would you like to have return to you? I like this game in theory. Futuristic RPG. I like that the dungeons were actually dangerous and could potentially kill you. Welcome to the teleport station. For just 60 Masetta, we can teleport you to any town which you know of. If you know the name of a town, you can use our service. Well, then come later. Okay. In practice. Uh, you know what I hate most about streaming RPGs, though? Having to read so much out loud? Yes. I agree. The zestiness is back. Hey, what's up, Legan? How you doing, dude? Why should I work for a living? Yeah, amen, sister. Welcome to Data Memory. AIDS needs 29 points to go up. Nay only needs 12. How's it going? I'm okay, I guess. Not too bad. We just finished up Mega Man 3. I have a hot crotch. It's true. Every syllable. We're going to adventure some more. Yes. Well, well, you are armed and look so brave, but if you don't keep your weapons in good shape, they're worth nothing. Wait, what? If you have money, you can always get your body cloned at the clone lab. Now, oh, what in the hell? What are you talking about, goddammit? Whoa! This is a central something, Pasio, capital of Moda. They say that if you go to the North Bridge, a guy named Darum will rob you of your money. Okay. Your hand kills on point. Damn it, Bobby. Thanks to your biosystems, whatever. Can you clone someone's penis and attach it to their head so they'll be called Dickhead everywhere they go? Yes. I'll do my best. Start a GoFundMe. I'm so fucking hungry, goddammit, and someone in Underscore's Discord posted a photo of a breakfast pizza he conceived. What? Egg, hash brown, and bacon on a fucking pizza? Or, like, what? Really valid use for cloning? Welcome, what would you like? I don't know. What do I have? From now on, women should be armed and should fight. I believe in that. Maybe you should go back home when you get to a strange town. There might be someone strange who comes looking for you. Mm-hmm. When I grow up, I'm going to be a thief. An asshole. Ah, uh, breakfast pizza, scrambled eggs, spinach, onions, pepper, turkey bacon, turkey sausage. What the fuck? Ah, uh, low-sodium cheese on, no salt salsa on a thin crust. That sounds fucking awesome, dude. Now I'm hungry both for breakfast food and pizza. Monomot? Dimate? What the fuck is all this crap? Skate pipe? 
I could slam a whole fucking pizza right now. You're that hungry? What do you eat for dinner? Why does spinach always look like something someone sneezed out? I love spinach. Welcome to my shop. Dude, I don't know what any of this crap is. Plain ramen, rice, and seven gyoza. Doesn't sound bad. I'm your snack for someone like me. Why don't you make something to eat, then? When Fantasy Star was cool, I tell you what, no cap, my bussy is bussin'. I think Brussels sprouts are my favorite green veggie now. They're okay. Yeah, it's late and I just brushed my teeth. Oh my. I can't use techniques, okay. Oh, equip. And the bussy's squirtin'. They air fry so well? Really? Brussels sprouts. Starts. Yeah, they finish air frying at the same time as a steak or chicken pellet. Oh, okay. I still never used one of those air fryers before. Have you played this <laughs> one leg in? Put some salt and lemon pepper on them and you're solid. Yeah. Five? Oh, this is going to be fun, isn't it? Okay. You just remind me to look it up, old friend. You can air fry unagi. Tomorrow or Sunday, I'm making Indian curry for dinner. Oh, my God. So tasty, dude. I can't believe how tasty that shit is. I've gone my whole life without that. The only thing I don't miss is the flashing seizure induce of the enemy attacking you. So you actually played this back in the day? Did you beat it? Roasted Brussels sprouts are excellent. I do roasted veggies every week. It's not hard to make curry yourself. I guess. I could learn how to do it. Yeah, I borrowed them from a buddy a long time ago. Uh, most of my dinners is a slice of meat and some kind of vegetable baked or air fried. Sounds like a good fucking meal. The game probably uses the green cross since it violates the Geneva Convention to use a red cross, but a green cross now means weed store. Oh shit. How about you attack? Thank you. Or miss. Okay. Oh, man. Dude, you're missing- oh, man, I'm missing so many times. That doesn't look like a bee, it looks like a giant fucking housefly. I remember how bad the RNG could be in this game. Yeah, I'm feeling it. Nay went up a level. Thank god. Alright. Now to go fucking heal and save. Hey, Dread, how's it going, dude? How's your afternoon? Someday I hope to violate the Geneva Convention? Yeah. Good to have goals. Wait a minute, is that a Sega fan? No! A little character named AIDS. Gotta call him something. Might as well be AIDS. <sighs> hey, where the hell do you save?
pretty sure last time I had chili, I violated it. Ah. Jesus, fuck. Ah, uh, you'd feel a love he has for this game. Yep. Ah! Well, the Geneva Convention, unfortunately, I forgot to violate the chili. You didn't have sex with chili? Bless you. Thank you. Thank you so very much. More lemonade? Fuck, this game's gonna take me forever, isn't it? Mod views shows you unbanned Godzilla a couple days ago. What happened? I don't know. He was begging Chozo to message me, saying how much he apologized and he'll never do it again or whatever. Like a rhinestone cowboy touched for the very first time. What's a rhinestone cowboy? What's a trouser snake? As if. Yeah, we'll see. Back to the brig. This is gonna be a fucking slog. He's in probation, gotta lick Sega Bussy to get back in the good graces. Gotta quit pissing everybody off all the time. That reminds me, I heard a folk song saying mostly in the... Quetchuan language? is cool. Now what the hell is that? Apparently they make washer-dryer combos now in one unit. Blew my mind? Oh, what? Oh good, it's AIDS and Victorious. You ever watch two streams at once? Me? I always have two open for people. I'm always lurking. You, know. you unbanned? He kept begging people to message me, saying how sorry he is. I remember grinding for hours on the mobile version of this at work and basically getting nowhere all the while. Yeah, that's what I'm expecting. It's the language the Incan spoke. Whatever happened to them? They got put in the shredder. All of them. Still around 7 million native speakers of Wetchuan and Peru and Chile. Good to see that Canadian face again. Sir, do you want to pee in my mouth? Maybe you shouldn't be fucking annoying to everyone and you wouldn't get banned. True. Well, I'm dead. They have native speakers at Chili's? Uh-oh. Oh my god, I lived. The leaf face does give me the urge to take out my rake. I also had an Incan drink earlier. Today, maybe made from maca powder? I have no idea what the hell that is. How is it? Baby Baku Ribusu? This is gay, I'm not making dinner that early again. Yeah, man, 3.30, what the hell? It's okay, it's usually mixed with cocoa. Hmm. Hey, Sixel, how you doing? How's the rest of your afternoon? Sounds like something that would get you quadra high. Did you get quadra high? I want to get quadra high. Walk has similar properties to ginseng?
So it's kind of like a ginseng drink? A plain ramen bowl of rice and some gyoza? Well, I mean, as long as I'm missing repeatedly, this should go by quick. So I gotta do, like, 12 of those battles minimum just to level up once. Maka's a flavor that complements cocoa. May go well with peanut butter, too. Weird. Homemade gyoza are frozen. Uh, McDonald's. The cover art of this game makes me leak pre-cum. I miss the pure soul of old... Old art. Yeah. The artwork is awesome. When I get knocked down, I get up again. You sure? We have ginseng crackers at my store. They're really nice, but I can only have a third of the bag at a time. The taste is too much. Frozen? Ain't nobody got time for that. When I get knocked up. Ugh. <sighs> Am I really gonna fucking die right here? God fucking damn it. I get knocked up all the time. I heard about Chumba Wumba once, they were anarchists, and apparently they once were on an album called Fuck EMI and later signed to EMI. Yeah, they started as like an anarcho punk band back in like 82 or something. So how long is this winter gonna take? I don't know, like fucking 30 hours or something absolutely retarded. You know, a game this badass to fucking drag on forever. Remember those beautiful backgrounds in one? I know, right? They were fucking stunning for an 8-bit game. Fantastic, I know. I thought about making Incan food sometime? But I'm just not that eager to bite into a guinea pig? <laughs> yeah, that sounds fucking awful. They'll probably bite you back. We're Anarcho Punk, but there's money? <laughs> Fantasy Star 1 was one of those lightning in a bottle games. It was so fucking good. And then they came out with this. Don't be hating, man. I love it good. Guess wanted some crazy scrolling effects. Oh, yeah. For sure. Oh, Fantasy Star 1. Jesus fucking Christ. Um, yeah, I know. What the hell? Those first person segments? What the hell? I mean, you eat a common Inken staple probably weekly, if not daily. What? Diarrhea? Potatoes? Actually, I made shepherd's pie tonight. <sighs> oh, tat. The remake of one of these on the PS2 had a bussin' soundtrack? The bus revving its engine? There you go, Incan influenced meal? A potato? Or shepherd pie. You have to read patat. Potat. It's a night for me every Friday. Don't forget the mud. What is mud? Puddle of mud? I hate potatoes. I don't find them to be buttin'. This game does do some really cool stuff, and I understand not wanting to stream it. Yeah, this is gonna be, like, the grindiest thing I've had to do on my channel, I think. If I had, like, Harvest Moon 2 on the Game Boy. What? Potatoes are excellent? Fuck yeah. The cover art is pretty gangster for sure. Potatoes are just a carrier for toppings. Take the topping off and they're miserable. Well, yeah, I mean, you ever bite into a cucumber? It's just crunchy water. Like, vegetables aren't supposed to taste good. What about french fries? I hate french fries. What the fuck? Ong? I know, right? Love me some crunchy water. I'd bite a raw-ass cucumber. Omega? I don't get them. <laughs> Ever bite into an uncooked piece of chicken? Doesn't taste good either. Oh, yeah. Love me my water veggies? Wow. We have a pretentious brand of chips in my store in the back of the description saying to enjoy the complicated flavors of potatoes or some shit. The cheap chips, calm down. Uh, french fries are the best. It's true. Also gives you superpowers. Yeah. The power to die with a swamp ass. 
I am Crunchy the Clown. Have you cooked chicken without seasoning it or even steak? It's terrible. Good point. Whiskey fries with a goat? All food sucks without seasoning. You're the goat? I guess curly is the canonical term. Yes. Is curly fries so, so good? Imagine what your curry would taste like with no seasonings. Yeah, exactly. Bad. Heal me, Doc. I got AIDS. I do things that taste round? Another dose, Doc, please. When I was a kid in for lunch, they had french fries in the shape of smiley faces. Yeah, I still see those once in a while. Never get them. The point of curry is the spices. You don't put seasoning on curry. Grindy the clown? Yeah, oh, fuck. Beekle is the seasoning on curry. Dude, it's so good. I wanna try curry on curly fries now, that'd be metal. Yeah, that sounds fucking awesome. do that in the UK. They call it curry sauce? I heard, I heard UK doesn't make good food, though. It does? I've yet to be given irrefutable evidence of the UK existing. What's up, new music? How you doing, man? I've been having typo issues lately, but I love cummy sauce. Oh, shit. If you like Indian food, I would recommend going to England. That makes sense. Ha ha ha. Curry. Take it back. He knows what he wrote. Going to England for Indian food? Who? I read what I read. I love cummy sauce. Dad? Chicken tikka is actually English. A lot of these Incan Peruvian foods I'm looking at use ingredients we just don't have access to. Guinea pig? I knew it! Hmm. Mine's is homemade. Does yours have blood in it too? Yes. Good. Make sure to use all the mega memory that this game provides. I'm gonna want amnesia halfway through this. I wanted to see a symphony orchestra play John Williams music tonight. Kinda inspired, but nothing like some bloody cummy sauce. You actually went to something like that tonight? Fun time or what? Wait, whose cum sauce has blood in it? Everyone. Love that seizure-inducing red and blue flashing, it's wonderful. Yeah, 
Fertilicious is an understatement. Boom. Oh, man. Yeah, a really professional concert with interview footage between the conductor and John Williams himself. I have no idea who that is. But it sounds important. If he's himself. He did Star Wars music. Oh, okay. There you go. Among other things, of course, yeah. We were victorious. At least he's not a douche like John Edwards. Who the fuck is that? What's he wearing? Um... Wait, paralyzed? Fuck off. Here's the music for Star Wars, Indiana Jones, The Olympics, NBC theme, Harry Potter, Home Alone, JFK, Blood Cummy, damn it, just keeps going. Kill one of them. Come on, guys. Thank you. Holy crap. Elegos, have you beaten this at least? You're obsessed with cum sauce? Who isn't? Uh, Close Encounters of the Turd Kind. You wrote the score for it? I don't think I've seen that. It's such amazing cum scoring abilities. Cum sauce of the Western soy sauce. In the future with lots of technology, evening, cloning, and spaceships, but nothing could bring back that man's hairline? Yep. Sounds like the future. Boring. I need some more juice. We finally went up a level. Both of them. Alright, I guess it's time to try and move on. North. How your shit top holding up? Um, seems fine, right? Seems to be working. Nothing's smoking. Except me. See how shitty they made the fucking purchasing new equipment. You're smoking all right. Not giving you the finger? No, dude, nothing. Nothing at all. Nothing at all. Nothing at all. Try and get a better weapon, I guess. It's fucking taking forever to grind.
We got items and shield. Where the fuck's the weapon? There you are. I never played this. Shut up. There's no way. Glittering and glittering end. Eh. This is going to be fantasy grind too. Pretty much, dude. Okay, he's got a knife. Um. Okay, what does she have? Ah, uh, lol. Ribbon. Dude, it doesn't even tell you who can use it and if it ups any stats. Why the fuck do you have to make it so shitty? Super troopers? You only need to grind it to level 5? Wait, I have to keep grinding here? Are you serious or are you just fucking with me? There's no way to tell what's better for you. That sucks. Um, you have to stay there and kill Boris for 60 levels. You did the right thing. Wait, you must be joking? Why? Can she not use it? Four minimum, but five would be optimal. Oh, he's serious. Okay. When he says you're joking, that means they can't use it, right? Is that their way of... <sighs> Fuck off. Did she not get a weapon, or what? Oh, okay. Hmm. Boom. Character description, don't say what they can wield? Uh, nope. Of course not. Why would they? Wait, joking? Oh, you're so stupid, game. Wait, was she not attacking this entire time I was grinding? Hey CJ, how's it going man? I've calculated enough data? For what? She was sitting there looking good, taking it like a slut she is. He's still not attacking, is she? Does the stupid cat lady just not attack? Who, me or CJ? my bedtime. Have fun suffering. Thanks. Thanks. Alright, have a good sleep, dude. Thanks for hanging out. What the fuck is this? Alright, what level am I at? Um... Three? 
You ever defending is indicated by the shield icon? Oh, okay. Um, all the above. But my guy always runs out of shit. My guy always runs out of HP right away. She's not fucking shielding me from anything. Um, how do you change her to not be a fucking person who's just guarding all the time? Oh, for fuck's sakes. All the above. In battle, I think? Oh, okay. All right, CJ, what's your game? In battle, go to strategy? Okay. Ah, Mario's Adventure, Super Mario Bros. 3 hack. I'm at eight and a half hour game time. Almost at the end, so roughly 10 hours tops, minus two hours because Sega is a badass at platformers. Mario's Adventure. Okay. <sighs> hey, Retro, how's it going? Oh, thanks for the lurk. If you're level five, <laughs> yeah. Um, and have all the equipment upgrades. Uh, you're fine for the next dungeon. Remember, you get a new party member at your house in Pasio. After every new town you visit, go to the next town for the third character. Uh... Okay. Aren't you happy that I pick an RPG this time? Yeah, it should be fun, I hope. How are you liking it? Hit or miss? Oh, you don't like it? Well, this should go a little quicker now that she's attacking. Brilliant ROM hack, but you know how these ROM hacks can be. Who is this whore and why won't you be my friend? Have you tried not calling her a whore, sir? Well, what else shall I call her? Her name? Mother Teresa, except for excerpt from my new book, The Erotic Adventures of Sir Isaac Newton. Uh, I like it. Everyone go buy a copy. AIDS and Party R? R-D-R-R. All right, I need to put some juice in my vape. Any of them can you fit in it? Uh, four? This is going way fucking quicker now. God damn it. I wish I knew that from the get go. Better late than not being covered in cum. Oh, Papa. Grind to level five. Yeah, 
He didn't ask her, maybe he did. I've been kicked in the head 80 times. Aids and party are victorious. Yeah, this is gonna be a fucking slog. Well, I mean, it is moving quite a bit quicker now. Nay is already at level 6. I obviously need to get the main character to level 5, right? You fixed it to my life? Wait, what do you mean? It's playing it now? Yeah? I didn't do anything. Yes? Road to golf, million? Water you dumped on your laptop fixed it. Congrats! It's holy water. Just blessed year. How's everyone? What's up, 2005? How's the rest of your afternoon? What are you doing up so late? Road to Master Million? Drinking water, that's a good idea. Holy fuck. Fuck it. Heal again. Does it look like the mosquitoes I'm currently at war with? How do they get in? Do you have a screen on your window? Or are you sleeping outside? I should drink water too, but I don't have any at the moment. What do you mean you don't have any water?
who's winning the war? Why not? I have no idea where they're coming from. My windows are closed. That's fucking weird. You have a chimney? Road to Hydro Million? Haley, you'd bed netter get up before I tell your legal guardian? That'll learn him. Mosquitoes are giving me Zika and Ebola? That's malarious. Is that all? Yeah, rookie. Saving malaria for my birthday. Oh, word. Oh, man. It's stingy with experience. Immensely so. I should get some water because I'm not feeling the greatest. Yeah, you should always be drinking water. Hey, Phoenix, what's up, dude? How's your afternoon? Hi, handsome. You ever play this one? Beer, coffee. Is it good? Not really. Not fucking really. Sprite work is nice? Yeah, it's decent. I agree. Nate touches AIDS wounds. Oh, I just carve that into a bathroom stall. AIDS looks nice. Oh, to the fuck about it. I started a company and we are the foreskin of cutting edge catheter to mouth liquid filtration technologies. Can I be a test subject? I'm feeling a mite. Ish. You have my investment of a hundred pennies. Now they're over budget. Thank you, no refunds.
Jesus Christ. I'm already getting bored of this. That equals one US dollar for any leaf bros. Thanks for the gift sub, Elegos. Boom. I heard that technology sucks and drains. It also leaks. Get a plate. Buckle up, Buster, because you got three of these. Yep. Fucking shoot me. Hey, Dojimbo, thanks for the raid, dude. How'd the rest of your stream go? Shoot me first. Dojimbers. It was good, we got two more DLCs and we finished Kakarot. Oh, you're finally done it for like once and for all? Looks like it went over 9,000. Holy crap. Oh, Jesus fucking Christ. Man, we've got to be getting close to level 5, right? Would you rather do this grinding or hear about intergalactic trade policies? I like the fucking prequel trilogy, man. At least you got your nay to smack her titties at monsters now. Yeah, speeds it up a little bit. If I keep getting paralyzed over and over. I will make it legal. Well, you let it my life. Can you and Mel become a thruple? I know she wants it. You'll have to talk to her. have sex with her and I'll just go out shopping with her? Man, she would have so much fun shopping with you.
Nay? Ugh. Not even who I needed to go up a level. Fuck. AIDS and party? He's not much of a party. Look at this thing. This blockade is totally legal. TOS. What isn't? Everything's illegal nowadays. Everything. Now this is pod racing. Bug the teenager for a new laptop. Hey, Unix, how you doing, dude? Oh, man, this is my old one. God damn it. Fuck yeah. One of the homies bought one, one, my more pricey game, so I don't have to deal with stupid people. Fuck yeah. Which one? While flying a starship. Holy shit, who knew you could fix a laptop? How's your day so far? I would say mugged a moose who mugged it from a teenager. Same thing. I'm doing fine, how are you doing? I'm fine. Totally fine. Did it just dry out and work? Yeah, yeah, pretty much, dude. Explained it all in my Discord if you want to check it out in more detail. Ow. Uh. The public credits will do fine. No, they won't. Gold press latinum. That's what you need. God, why is this taking so long? Son of a bitch. Wait a minute, this isn't Virtual Breeder Star Simulator? Kinda. He needs a nude hack, desperately. Oh, to answer your question, Felix the Cat. That was a fun little game. I liked it. Never came out on Famicom, but I want to dump it and get more cooler shit. Seriously? Oh, fuck. That's weird. It's such a good game, too.
think the Game Boy one did, but not 100%. Is it just the same fucking thing, but black and white? And slow? Yeah, same hand to scale down. What do you mean? How's the rest of your afternoon, dude? Fantasy Star, Star Fantasy Star 1 is the coolest in my opinion? Yeah, dude. Fantasy Star 1 is so fucking good. This game is a little pricey, but seems like it dropped a bit. Oh, Fe How much is Felix? What Fantasy Star is this? Two. I believe the ROM cost is zero dollars? That's too pricey. Holy shit, I can redeem Fantasy Star Online, tempting. Ugh. Oh, finally. LaMeo, fuck. I love Fancy Star. Hey, what's up, Map? How you doing, dude? So, one of your Fantasy Star games is a thing where you have to check your status or the level of bonuses that don't apply. Wasn't that four? It used to be 100 to 120 US. Seems about 80 to 90 now. I don't mind giving the homie a better price, because fuck eBay. Uh, the look of despair on Sega's face when you said fantasy. Yeah, dude. Uh, maybe Fantasy Star 4. Haven't the majority of NES games dropped in price? Yeah, pretty much. it's very much appeals to an older market. GameCube is the hot thing now. Weird, right? Oh, uh, yeah, pretty much. I've sold, like, 50 to 60 of them, and most dropped. Oh, it actually worked? I wonder once our generation dies, if NES Super Nintendo will become worthless, like 2600 is it now? Probably, for the most part. I never really kept up with the values until recently, as I was listening. Yeah, it makes sense. Um. Yeah, I haven't been in the scene in, like, fucking five years. Every time somebody's like, oh man, I got Super Mario Sunshine for a steal, only a hundred bucks. I'm like, what the fucking... What? Prices of fucking retro games terrify me. I don't even look into it anymore. Twenty nineteen is when I noped out. Yeah, even by then they were retarded. Oh yeah, let alone post COVID. I remember being salty as early as like twenty fifteen. Same here, dude. 2015 hit, and I was like, ugh. And then by 2019, I just sold everything. I was like, fuck this. Well, I'd argue that NES Super Nintendo will hold up better than Atari Colored Blocks, but I don't know, I'm not a youngin'. 
Yeah, dude. Fucking kids nowadays think the Xbox 360 is, like, ancient. Like... Weird. A PS4 to, like, teenagers now is, like, Super Nintendo when we were growing up, you know? Um, equip. Can't stop sneezing? Prove it. Ah, uh, why did they call it the 360? You walk up to it, do a 360, and walk away? Exactly. At this point, I'm just scaring my cats. Gotta get that come out somehow. <laughs> Wait, what's the one thing she can equip? A steel bar? Can I equip fucking two of them? Ah, uh, my iPad kid niece asks me if I can play a game with better graphics, but her dumbass generation's addicted to Roblox? I don't know, it's weird, right? supposed to be able to afford everything. I mowed my lawn, apparently that is some plant sperm my body hates. You got like a rash or what? I can't afford any of this crap. Why the fuck did he tell me to... Ah, uh, you can't buy any of this shit. No, just sneezing? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait, some plant spermed you? For free? Shower after it, you dumb fuck? The answer to all questions is grind. Yeah. I don't want to grind anymore. I did you, cunt. Use Game Shark code and come back tomorrow and convince us you power leveled all night. Get to level 99 with two characters. Luckily, I got good deals on all the North American games I buy, so I'm still making a few bucks, but I just don't care. I want more Sega, MSX, and PC Engine to take its place. Understandable. I think Nintendo stuff will always have some type of value because people act like Nintendo invented video games, but I think Sega Sony stuff will tank in value, and even third-party Nintendo stuff. Every plant is just spreading their seed. Wait, he's attacking them with 6 and 6 before he was doing 8. How the hell is that an upgrade for 700 Masetta? Nintendo is a fucking insane cult of personality. No other game company's close. Well, they make great shit. I see why people love Nintendo. And look at this fucking thing. Crazy how small my collection is. Yeah, but it's not about the number, right? It's about all the cool shit. This piece of shit was like 100 US in 99, or in 90 or whatever. For personal home video games, I would Atari. Otherwise, it was all arcades, baby. My collection is zero games. Why in the world did you come to Arima? This is such a horrible place. 
Uh, why do we go through this every time? Is it about to be winter for you? I know, the hideout of those scoundrels is at a building in Shure? The scoundrels must have two more dynamite sticks, and once we take them away, another town will be destroyed. shit how this has dumbass grid backgrounds. You have the smaller cart size fantasy star and wanted detailed backgrounds. Yeah, dude, it's definitely a step down, right? Wow, look at all that. Um, pretty much already is. I figured. I hear that those bad guys are very cautious and keep their stuff in a locked container. The scoundrels stole all the food, killed all the men, and kidnapped all the women. I haven't had a hot day in over a month. Upside down Australians. Dude, isn't it weird? I get it, you're smart, I'm retarded, dirk a dirt, downloading all the ROMs, I know I have Everdrives, I just like things. Sonic Gun, I like how fast it goes. Those who are left here are just the powerless who are only waiting to die. Darum is not a bad guy, the reason he became violent is that his daughter, Haim, was kidnapped. Sonic Gun, I wonder how fast it goes. Quick. The town's been wiped out by the scoundrels, and there's nothing left. The scoundrels always come from the east. Good tune, eh? If only those scoundrels hadn't come to this town, Darum and his daughter, Tame, could have lived a happy life. What's most frightening is humans and not monsters. The scoundrels blew up everyone's houses with dynamite. Somebody had to do it. Once you go to the first town, I head back. And I'll have a new person? If I knew that, I would have fucking went way earlier. Fantasy Star 4 was peak Sega, how they had no desire to release it in the West. Waited like two years, and by the time they translated and released it, Saturn's already out, just peak 90 Sega. Yep. They brought over two and three. They're not hooligans, they're specifically scoundrels. Huge difference. Okay, which one's my house? Knock at the door. I'm sorry to intrude, but I've heard that Aids and Nay are trying to solve the mystery of the bio monsters. I'm a professional bio monster hunter. I have little talent except that I'm good with a gun. I also want to go with you. My name is Rudo, which is short for Rudolf Steiner. Maybe you think you know a better name for me? I love Fantasy Star Online as a kid, but I never played any of the original games until emulation. And you liked one and four? He's level fucking one. Dude. I should have just grabbed him right away. Fuck, man. Now I gotta go back to grinding. I'm sorry to intrude, but I heard you have AIDS. Can I have some? Okay, thanks. One's my favorite, two's the worst. Yeah, this is... Uh... There's certain things I wish I knew from the get-go that would have exas exacerbated the fucking grindage. Anything happened to me, but much later, now that I'm recalling this? But where the hell is my other guy?
Wait, what? Part of taking Shining in the Darkness over this anything in the 90s? Yeah, Shining in the Darkness is great. Whoops, what am I doing? Then they turn it into a tactical RPG because Sega are a big retard. What? The Shining had a lot of different genres, dude. You got RPGs, action RPGs, tactical RPGs. The Shining series is all over the place. I mean, they put out Shining Holy Ark on Saturn, like, many, many years later, and it's the same shit. RPG real penis gangs. Now I like them even more. It started as a dungeon crawler and didn't return to it until the Saturn. The Genesis was one dungeon crawler, then like four years of tactical RPGs. Yeah, the Shining Force games were their tactical branch. Then you had like your fucking Shining Holy Ark and Shining uh, in the Darkness. And then you had like your Shining Wisdoms and blah 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 blah. Fuck, now I have to grind again. Before I even grinded, I should have just walked to that town to get a third character. Fuck, man. Uh, the Saturn sold like two units in the West to most people. Western people, it may as well have just been a tactical RPG series. What is the Shining game on Saturn that looks like a Genesis game? Like, they didn't even try to update the graphics? Uh, you had Shining Wisdom, Shining the Holy Ark, and Shining Force 3. Shining Wisdom? What? That game was beautiful. You're fucking crazy. Rudo got some HP for being level 1. This is gonna be so grindy. The dungeon crawler's super pretty. Shining Holy Ark? Yeah. Yeah. I was kind of bummed that it did, like, an auto-map thing for you, you know? When I first got it. I would say have the party carry his ass until he catches up. Yeah, but he needs some fucking weapons and shit. He needs something, right? You'd think? I don't know. Hello, Shining Wisdom literally just looks like a Genesis game with a few more colors. <laughs> if I paid 300 bucks for a Saturn and got that, I would have been so salty it didn't even look like next gen 2D like a stall or Capcom shit. Yeah, the graphics weren't amazing, but the game was good. I liked the graphics a lot. But they weren't, like, the shiniest that they could have been. He Anna's no TP for his bunghole? Has? TP for his bunghole. Where the fuck do you want me to go, game? Uh. 
Great Cornholio. Whoa, what the hell is that? Bows? Oh, okay. Brand new gigantic enemy dies just as easy as the other ones? That's good. The overworld music in this game is some interesting music. Yeah, it is, for sure. You got an upcoming Visa Butthead game? Yeah, after the Elegod month. Or two. A non-issue? Also 90s holding, hold waiting music? You sell Cornholio TP? I've seen that face, he tried to kill Nay seven months ago, this is bad news, let's go back for a while? Oh, okay. Has Beavis quotes on it? On the PS1? Game or whatever? Age should just slap him with his penis, that ought to learn him. That'll learn him, stupid bugs. The TP? Oh. Ever place to save here? Uh, it's strange how the Genesis sold like two units in Japan and the Saturn did extremely well. It is weird, right? Ugh. Right, let's just go right, I guess. That's usually how I toss my salad with bugs. Not going right. Dreamcast seemed to do well in Japan. Also, 98 launch probably didn't help since Saturn was still going strong. But it wouldn't be Sega without a botched launch, I guess. Yeah. You're not wrong, dude. Dreamcast should have launched in the West first? Uh, yeah, well... They launched a lot earlier than fucking GameCube, PS2, and Xbox here. But everybody's waiting, because, you know, DVD player. Saturn is already retired. Yeah, well, Sony had unlimited ad money. Dreamcast never had a chance anytime. If I did anything right, Sony would just do ads promising how good the PS2 was. Who cares if the promises were fake? Fake? What do you mean? I 
I keep hearing Foo Fighters in the music. Really? Which song? On the potential of PS2, yes, PS2. You can communicate to a new cyber city. This will be the ideal home server. Did you see the movie The Matrix? Same interface, same concept. Starting with the next year, you can jack into The Matrix. What? Here goes my hero. Ever schlong? Waspy. <laughs> uh, that's what Ken Kutaragi said about PS2 in 99. He was CEO of PlayStation. What a dick. Your character has Oiza? Sure does. They just did weird ass promises like that. Come on. Pizza? It's not the same rhythm, but same climbing notes. Oh, okay. Trippy. Copyright? Oh. Oh, here's something. Oh, fuck. This is the dungeon, isn't it? Oh, that's right. This ugly fucking overhead shit. Ugh. Man, there's no point showing this shit. Right? They wanted to make it, like, look super cool or something, but it's just kind of, like, in the way. Dreamcast back in like 2000 and I loved it. I didn't get a PS2 until 2003 ish. Yeah, my mom randomly got me a PS2 for like my fucking 11th or 12th birthday. With Grand Theft Auto. And I remember I had like five fucking friends over for like a sleepover. That was a really fun birthday. Damn it. <laughs> Grand Theft Auto 3 Vice City were the first big games that made me really jealous of not having a PS2. And I coped myself into thinking a Dreamcast port of Grand Theft Auto 3 had to happen. It wouldn't be able to handle it, would it? It'd have to be more than one disc, probably. First PS2 I got when Final Fantasy X first released in the West. You got it for Final Fantasy X specifically? Yeah, I got that and dot .hack. Oh, dot .hack games, okay. Yeah, I think disc limit would be the issue. 900 megabytes is a killer when PS2 is like 4.7 gigabytes. Yeah. I went from Dreamcast to OG Xbox, and I'll bet you can guess why. The Sega games? They both ran Windows? Oh, are you going to say Shenmue?
Indeed. As well as Jet Set Radio Future. <sighs> yeah, a lot of Sega shit on the Xbox. I think I got into Shenmue too late to respect it. I got it after Grand Theft Auto 3 came out and I was just salty. It wasn't GTA 3, lol. No regret. Oh, this place sucks. Some regards? Just a few. PS2 is the best investment, though. One of the best gen, releasing a boatload of games. Yeah. I remember when I was, like, fucking 12 or 13. My buddy, like, wanted to trade me a... Dark Cloud for, uh, one of my extra CD players, my Walkmans, because his mom bought it for him thinking it was like Zelda, and he just fucking hated it, somehow. This is the first dungeon of the game, and it's already excruciating. Dark Cloud of Zelda at home? I fucking love Dark Cloud. Dreamcast Online also never launched in Australia, so that was super cool. So I had to play Fantasy Star Online single player like an uncultured swine. Headgear. Quick, somebody play the adolescence. Dungeon has the word dung in it. It's true. You got a point. Zelda's hide light at home. <laughs> Having fun. Oh yeah, dude. Time of my life. Exactly what I thought it'd be. Really confusing, shitty dungeons, and 95% of it's grinding. It's exactly like I remember it. Uh, they still released it there, despite not having the online. Uh, Dark Cloud gave you a real nice learning curve if you were used to more laid-back casual games. I fucking love that game, dude. Everything about it. I don't know if it's nostalgia or what, but I absolutely love it. Why wouldn't they? It still has 300 plus hours of offline content. I know life Fantasy Star Online, even. Oh, what are you? I'm yawning and I keep dozing off. I think I pooped my pants. I pants my poop. <laughs> he caught the shit poop! <laughs> hey, it's you still. Prove it. Hey, what the hell are my stats? Um, I should heal... Those two. Um, oh, fuck. Oh, crap.
Fuck, I love the Dreamcast early PS2 era. You excited for PS2 games? I recall enjoying this game, but it being pretty brutal. Yeah, yeah. Pretty brutal, for sure. No, because Dumb Fox will just pick the 82 Call of Duties and shit. What's your thoughts so far? Exactly like I remember it. Like 95% grinding, and then the fucking dungeons are really confusing, shitty mazes. Fantasy Star 1 is infinitely better. Yeah, that's about right. PS2 has so much fucking jank, it makes PS1 seem tame. Yeah, definitely all looking forward to it. If people weren't assholes, it would be fun to see you play PS2. I'm sure half of it'll... Well, it's like any other fucking... It's like PS1. One out of five games is going to be awesome. One's going to be shit, and the other three are going to be mediocre. I do love the animations and the music here. Yeah, it looks good. It sounds good. It's just kind of monotonous as hell. Even as far as RPGs go. Everyone remembers the good PS2 games, but there's so much bad shit, like, really, really bad. Yeah, I bet, dude. I don't know, my first PS1 game was Xena, and that shit was a jank. Stuff like Phoenix games, where they barely even function. Wait, it's locked. Luna? Oh, yeah, she's hyper. I replayed a couple childhood games, and I hate them now. A good sign. Where am I? What am I doing? Fuck this. Don't you ever play anything good? Hey, what's up, Desmond? How you doing, man? We beat Batman on Genesis today. And we beat Mega Man 3 today. Now we're gonna be doing this for a few days. Mostly because of the controls. Oh, okay. Yeah, I didn't have a ton of PS2 shit. Uh, now look up stuff like Quest for Sleeping Beauty on PS2, which would barely even be a game on CDI, let alone PS2. People really have no idea how bad the jank levels go on PS2. Huh. Makes sense. You don't hear too much about it. I mean, when I played this, I loved it, but it's a slog when you look back at it. Oh my fuck is it ever. Most systems got stuff like that, don't they? Dude, I gotta, like, head back and fucking save now. Or I'm gonna lose all my progress. Locked. Okay. PS2 library is massive. Yeah, like thousands of games. PS2 had some insane number, like 5,000 games, and everyone remembers the top 200 best ones, leaving the other 4.8 thousand. The weird budget remake of this is on PS2. Have you played it? it? Sounds like something shitty that Izzy made with a crappy overseas third-party dev that went under and only made that game with no testing, aka shovelware. How do I get the fuck out of here? Disney doesn't own Sleeping Beauty, it's based on the book, which is like 500 years old. Most Disney stuff is public domain. There isn't a warp out spell, is there? Not that I have. All the flash looking remakes of 1 and 2. Fuck. 
The PS2 remakes of Fantasy Star are so ugly. Think of early 2000s budget animation, and you have an idea how it looks? Yeah, I'm sure it sucked. you get out of here. Ah, damn it. I don't think people think of Call of Duty on PS2. It did have some, but people think of Call of Duty as a PS3 era thing. I think it'll be fine. I was actually going to try this out on the Sega Collection, but, like, should I play the first one? I mean, you don't have to, but... This game sucks, and Fantasy Star 1 is amazing. There's still, like, four to five games on the PS2. PS2 got Call of Duty until, like, 2007. Call of Duty and Medal of Honor on PS2. Worst case, he runs through four to five short shooter campaigns. Alright, um... Well, I'm all out of healing. I need to find the exit, or I'm just gonna die and have to do everything again. Come on, game. Minus Hour and Rising Sun was fun? Okay. Are those Call of Duty games? I think Rising Sun was Medal of Honor, actually. When I dug my PSP out, I had a Call of Duty game installed on it, and I remember playing it a lot in school. But going back to it, holy fuck, single stick sucks. Yeah, I bet. It is. My grandpa watched me play Medal of Honor on PS2, and he told me about his time spent in Germany. It was horrific. <laughs> oh, man. It sounds like a nice, uh, sexy time. My bad, it was Medal of Honor. It's called Honor Duty Medal. All of Honor Duty Metal. Wait, we're at the beginning now, aren't we? I hope. Hello, well, that's like playing Monster Hunter. I played that shit on PSP like a thousand plus hours easy. And now the one analog stick is peak AIDS. Like, how the fuck did I do it? Times were different back then. Do sex, however, will probably happen. Do sex? Didn't talk about his time. Till in was over 10, so that's some consideration. I was. You said do sex? Exactly. Oh, this isn't the beginning? Yeah, the controls were the worst part of it for me. Yeah, I bet. Sounds about right. Fuck, what the fuck? Where the fuck am I? I always forget Deusex got a PS2 port. <sighs> Fuck. We're gonna fucking die in here. Uh, there's also a super shitty Half-Life port. What's that Half-Life port rules? See if it runs at 60 frames per second?
Fucking hit them! I'm so close to dying. Yeah, there you go, you fucking retard. Alright, let's fucking restart it again. Um, thanks the second you move the camera at wall 60 FPS. You know how it's not pronounced do sex? Are you being a funny bunny? Yeah, I'm trying to be funny, I guess. I can't play any Call of Duty games for PS3 era, I just can't do the controls. Alright, well, I guess two hours of grinding wasn't enough. I need to grind more. How many points do I have to spend for you to flash a nip? Alright, let's fucking raid out. This is all I can stomach tonight. I'm gonna grind like a motherfucker tomorrow morning. Maybe we can actually do something in the game tomorrow. That also had an exclusive co-op campaign. That was cool. I knew a funny guy in Nom got his head blown off. Thank you for playing. Thank you guys for sitting around watching this shit. Uh, 60 FPS dropping to 20 FPS every two seconds. Mm. Man, there's a lot of people on. Oh! What? Yo, 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 po? Um... Okay. Yo, yo... Yo... Po... Five? Okay. I just got here, you piss! Hey. Dude, I stream seven hours a day, man. It's your fault you show up 20 minutes to the end. Damn, you're already miserable. Yeah, this one sucks, dude. Uh, thanks for the stream. Love you, Wally. I appreciate it. He claims to? Have a good night, funny boy. Funny bunny? I don't know, nothing about no 20 FPS. The PS2 port of HL2 was extremely rushed. From Dreamcast, it was barely optimized since Gearbox wanted some fucking money. HL1. Poop. Alright. Thank you guys so much for hanging out. I appreciate it. Um, I'm gonna grind like a motherfucker tomorrow morning so I can just make it somewhere in my early stream. But, uh, Thank you guys for hanging out, I appreciate- Oh, well, I can see why you don't like it. Well, this is my first Fantasy Star game, yeah. Fantasy Star 1 is so much fucking better. 4 is supposed to be the best, but... I don't know. We have to do 2, 3, and 4 this month, so... I guess it's only uphill from here- or up from here. Everything's uphill. Grind my mother, you fucker! Always heard the opposite and played it myself. C equals 3? It's true. Alright, I hope you guys have a good night, and I'll talk to most of you guys tomorrow.